One simple tip when buying eggs at your local supermarket. Hey there, NJRoot22.com here with another kind of low carb chat, I guess, and a supermarket vlog. I guess I can put them into multiple playlists. I don't even know how to handle this. I'm gonna have to break up my YouTube channel into like five different channels this year. I don't know how I'm gonna do it. It takes a lot of time to do all this uh, management. But anyway, to cut to the chase, when you go to the supermarket, don't get hung up on all the different eggs. Just buy the cheapest freaking eggs you can. Why? Because it doesn't make really much of a difference after that point. Most, if not all eggs at a supermarket are way past the time that the eggs were laid. They're not nearly as fresh as they can be when you buy them from a, a local egg person. We have them in our neck of the woods here or from an egg farmer directly where you can just get them like a day or so after the eggs were laid. Uh, you can tell the freshness of an egg by looking at the color of the yolk. And if you ever, <laughs> once you get uh, hooked on these fresh eggs, the yolks are so incredibly dark, almost orange. That's how dark they are. The darker they are, the fresher they are. And once they become pale yellow, there are many weeks, many weeks, if not months, from the time that they came out of the chicken. And we found that even the stupid $8 super organic pasture-raised rip-offs of eggs are often as stale as I've ever seen. I mean, they were so pathetically almost white yellow. It was ridiculous, like pastel yellows. It's so bad. And they don't, they, those eggs, those expensive eggs don't move off the shelves nearly as fast as the cheaper eggs. I'm not going to say that you can't find a fresh batch uh, every now and then of any egg for that matter, but there's no way to know because they don't, I think I found one local farmer that wrote the, the, the date that the eggs were laid. And then they stopped that, uh, that movement after a few months and then they just put, put use by on it which doesn't make sense. I'd rather know uh, when the eggs were laid and make the decision myself. So don't waste your money on overpriced eggs at the supermarket. If, if, if the supermarket's the only place you're getting your eggs. Um, unless you get that feel good feeling of when you know, make sure everybody's watching you buy those uh, $10 eggs and so they think you're all uppity and all that. I don't, I, don't, I don't know, maybe there's some psychological effect of buying something that has some words on it that say organic or free range or pasture raised or I, I don't really care because you, there's no way you can prove that that egg is exactly what they say on the box. So we visit those local egg stands and you can get the freshest eggs ever. If you can go out of your way to find, find some, buy 10 dozen eggs and you'll you can keep them in your refrigerator for several weeks and they'll still be fresher than the eggs you get at the supermarket. And we, we pay anywhere from two to three dollars a dozen, sometimes four dollars, depending you can get these jumbo eggs. Lastly, the eggs you buy at a local farm stand are from some neighbor that has an egg coop in their, uh, house. They're not officially organic, but I tell you, they're probably a lot more pure and natural and wholesome than even the eggs at the organic because they go through all these processing plants. I'd rather someone just take the eggs, put them in a damn egg carton and uh, sell them to me. That's it. If you like what we're saying, hit the bell and the subscribe and all these other things and uh, enjoy your eggs.